Hello everybody, this looks really tough. Really tough, game number five. Down 200 TV to Dark Elves, maybe more, because he could have loners. No, he doesn't have loners. He does have a tackler though, a block tackle. Oh no, the bane. The bane of Amazons. 2-1-1. One, one. Interesting. Get a wizard. And a Bloodwiser babe. Yeah, like, you, but you're going to do it anyway. The point is, like, it only takes a season to get guard. So it's easy with dwarves, right? Dwarves are complete after one skill. Their entire team is complete after one skill. Whereas orcs... You know, their blitzes are complete after one skill. But the Black Orcs, which are harder to skill, need two. And Sauras, which are harder to skill, need two. And, like, most elves are... Com well, Dark Elves, obviously, most of them are complete after one skill. Um, some some elves just aren't ever complete, you know? Like, look at High Elves. There's something you'd want, you'd want to keep building forever. Um... With dwarves, of course, the runner can be never complete because you can just take you can just take stats on him. So you can always have a wonder runner as well. You can always just redraft some guards and your wonder runner who's played like ten seasons, and you can just keep doing that and keep doing it and keep doing it and keep doing it. No, oh. you had me at hello, Hancock. <laughs> <laughs> God. <laughs> yeah, guns are complete after Nooligan gets one skill, indeed, yeah. Yep, correct. Brother Bear. Hello! This is in, this is an incredible <laughs> this is an incredible comment on Battle Brothers Reddit and also applies to Blood Bowl. It's essentially what uh it's essentially what Store did. Amazing. Right, it is, this is the title, yep. Yeah. And then this is what he concluded. <laughs> So good. I wish. Oh, God. I mean, it is obviously, but it's 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 what Store did, didn't it? With with his with his one in nines, so where he just he just wrote down he just wrote down every time he failed a one in nine, he's like, that's one that's an one the first one in nine failed. <laughs> I rolled another one in nine, diced. <laughs>
Does he have a witch elf? Yes, but with the ball. Oh, look, this is good. The, the guard can go. Oh, but then it's getting tackled. Don't want the guard to get tackled. Block him, block him. Dodge out. Go up there, so I could have this one like here. Maybe here. Diced. I want to re-roll that because it's a bit shit scudding out. Maybe I should have done this one first, the ball down was okay. Flip me, guys. So don't reroll anything this turn. If it's an instant one in nine, it's an instant one in nine. I mean, obviously that's with blocks. So. <laughs> Sucks to give him the 2 plus out there, but then if I put him across, then this is too weak, I think. Maybe I should have moved over there. Maybe it wasn't so weak actually. Maybe I could have afforded to move him over there. Hmm, maybe. I didn't want to, but maybe I should have. Pretty parallel, but it might have been worth it. 
Because this leaving this two plus out does really suck, doesn't it? That guy into there is much better anyway. Really nice. Still got this pretty strong across. I think, I think that's pretty strong across, so I do. That happens to me sometimes. It's really tiring sometimes streaming, and then like I stop and I'm not even tired. I'm like, oh god, I've got to go to bed, and then I'm like, well, I'm not even tired now. What the fuck? Could I bore that? I'm not going to. I'm going to be greedy. Maybe I'm wrong to be. Hammers. <laughs> Hamez has never been serious in his life. I don't really want to re-roll, so I'll do the a block with block. And then a blockless block! Another blockless block. A full pow. Oh my god, what a dice lord, he's got to up all this. If he cares about winning at all, which obviously he does, there you go. I mean, I should have up all that kill if I cared about winning, but I think I'll win anyway. <laughs> what a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> I just think I'll win anyway. <laughs> oh god, it's true, what can I say? Diced, comedy mega. That was pretty nice. That was a pretty nice cars, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I could have whizzed that turn. I, I don't know. They're elves, though, aren't they? So I'm like, I, I, I want to keep in front of them and then just use the whiz to stop them scoring more than anything. Like rather than try and use it for a ball sack and counter score, I think. A little optimistic versus elves. Now, of course, a fireball with five players is a little bit tempting. 
A little bit. But I do feel like I can just get in the way again, just get in the way enough. Mm, this is super interesting, isn't it? I mean, I've got the whiz, so even if he does get a bit of a breakthrough, he, you know, I can whiz and recover it all probably anyway. I'd rather not one in nine here. I think don't even try. Sorry, Christopher. Like, you can't really stop L scoring, right? But if you get in the way a bit, you can get in the way a bit and just stop them getting through easy. That's all you can do, isn't it? And then you've got to hope that they've got to get through in the last turns, then you can whiz and just get out of it. And then they'll, the chance of turning, using the whiz to turn them over and get out 1 0 up is so low with Amazons, they're so slow. So dicey as well when they're trying to do anything. This is the thing, you had to like full power it to get through there, so it wasn't it wasn't too bad. It was a little weak, but it wasn't terrible. Yeah, you had to re-roll that. Unfortunately, the removals and the stun is making this a bit tricky, isn't it? A bit tricky. Lovely. Pretty good, you know. Just keep keep them parallel to their team. Try to try to cover the uh, you know the breakbacks and everything. I feel like I've played this okay. Maybe he could have been a touch more aggressive in spots, particularly the wizard. But you know, who cares? Not me. <laughs> Don't even care. <laughs>
double skulls, that's not so good for breaking through. <laughs> A one in nine, an instant one in nine would be quite good here, wouldn't it? Diced. Hello, Papa Piccio. Absolute full potato. Right? These bros do look weird, yeah. The best, the best one I think for this uh, for this situation is there should be an exclamation mark potato, but we do have. I have potato blood in my veins, <laughs> <laughs> which is pretty good. Lightning bolt. Z <laughs> oh, it's nice, isn't it? Woohoo! The crabs I gave my flatmates were the best crabs you could ever get, okay? Oh, GFI sucks. But I've got block. Uh, I really want to hit him and hit him. I have to hit him. So he's technically got some scoring threats still. I definitely just want to do this 1D. Right. So we should have a chance of a, of a like a long bomb or something on the last turn. Just rolling dice, clicking at random. Glorious. It was great armor break, wasn't it? Without the armor break, this would have been really difficult. Would have just had to dodge all those guys off instead of making blocks. And gone for a foul on the witch. First notch rustle. It's not hitting the ball, so definitely succeeded the defense. And have a shot to nothing with this uh, with this scoring threat. Where? Oh, diced. Diced. Well, he's the relay, so I have to blitz this one off and block here first. Yeah. 
So he goes here. You got to do the handoff, eh? That's probably best. No, I'm not gonna foul. We're gonna try and score. I had to try and score. It wasn't. It wasn't that unlikely. Three, three. A couple of dodges. A couple of GFIs. Four plus. Three with dodge. Obviously, no count score chance. Also, I don't have bench. <laughs> Chaos stay out on three pluses. Diced. Really should have uploaded that that guard. I could. I knew I should have uploaded that guard when it happened. But hey. Got the stop. Got equal play? No, I'm a man up. 10v9. But down in quality. Lost players. Um, but still, have one more man. Have the ball. On a blodger. So, there's a chance. Stop the uh, blitz from being as good. Seems the best idea. Best I could do. I didn't even have the bench in the end. Both both kills. Stay down. Powed. Full pow. Can I pull this kill? Baby. Oh, it's not a double one. But still, it's a reroll gun. <laughs> and a double one. Oh, guess who's getting fucking fouled? <laughs> guess which motherfucker's getting fouled? As long as I can pick up the ball. Use the non-block to hit the block. And then the block to hit the defenseless. Oh, brilliant play. Well done, Jim. Thank you, Jim. Pick up the ball. Actually, I should have gone one across for another assist there. run down here as a scoring threat? No. <laughs> Diced. But still recovers the, the guard a little bit, doesn't it? From the stun. Stato! <laughs> I 
Oh my god, my stomach is killing. It's been killing me for two days. Oh. Bit greedy this reroll. <laughs> Fucking Jim Fowl. Now we've got level players and he's got better players. It's not good, is it? Oh, I spent two turns dicking around fouling. But at least now both guards are up. And now it's the critical turn of can I move forward and leave him behind? And can it so he's probably gonna like you know try and really stop us moving forward this turn. Bit unlucky, isn't it? Like obviously he was unlucky at a double one, but also fouling him for two turns and getting two stuns for a send off is pretty shit. Okay, so he has to go out of the way, so goes first. This is the one that can go the least far. This one has to clear. Yep. This one has block. Accidental Vengabus here, but that's okay. Perfect Vengabus with a guard where you can't get this one in. Some people put it in the wrong place. Very bad play. Of course, Jim gets an accidental Vengabus and it's perfect. What can I say? What can I say? 10 out of 10 would play perfectly again. Oh, it's so good. So good at Blood Bowl. Do you know what, do you know what I've missed with me not playing Blood Bowl? Is just seeing somebody playing Blood Bowl this good. <laughs> <laughs> You know, it's, it's what I thought when I was playing Tom Schniz in the SFL quarterfinal. I was like, fuck, when was the last time I saw somebody play as good as me? I couldn't remember. I couldn't remember anybody playing as well as I played against Tom Schniz. That guy was fucking brilliant. Literally can't remember. Can't remember when I saw somebody playing as well as I played in that game. Oh, perfect.
Hmm. Oh, he's got block. I spotted that at the last second. Nearly took the boat down. Look at me counting sh counting squares. What a fucking professional. Professional Blood Bowl player counting squares. Outrageous. Outrageous. Count the squares, guys. You won't find sh count square <laughs> square counting like this anywhere else, guys. <laughs> Man, <laughs> taking up two players' actions just to punch her is pretty good. Like, just basing him is pretty decent. Because he's got to go back to get around and get relevant. But just making this dodge and getting here is also pretty strong. And then it's two free players. I really like them not having two free players. So I think not moving is best. What a fucking nerd. <laughs> Big grind nerd. Fair mad skills fair. I rarely count squares, but that was that was some good square counting. <laughs> that was some high quality counting right there. Jimmy Fantastic shit at this game. <laughs> That's a pretty good sound effect, isn't it? That's another one that I forget exists sometimes. I guess I forget all of them exist sometimes, because there's a lot of them, isn't there? Oh, look at that! I got the one! Oh, baby! The glorious reward for not moving her off. Oh, yes. So good. So good. Oh, so good at Blood so Bowl. Just imagine. You holiday, Can you imagine you, being this like good at Blood Bowl? Oh. With the team, uh, you just decide to play more fucking rats. What the fuck? <laughs> what would anyone play that much fucking rats? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I love the Jesus Christ at the end. <laughs> My brain is a potato. I remember that one. Right, this is a bit tricky now, isn't it? I might actually have to engage brain for this turn. Can I score? Could score. I'm this one can legitimately blitz. an idiot. <laughs> oh god. This might have to be the play. Eh? I think I'm just going to try and score. Take the draw. This is, I don't know what I can do here. There was no, like, no one in nine. No non one in nine disasters was the problem. If I'd power, full powered him or full powered him, things can happen, but. Yeah, good defence. Good defence that turned from him. Very good. There was, there was no. I could have taken risks. Obviously, I could have just. I could have started the turn with some one in nines. But if those fail, I just lose. Is the problem. 
So I'll take not losing over more chance of drawing, I think. I don't like losing. WP <laughs> No him Him he forced me a score I want to score on turn 8. Oh. Time to put the guard here. Hmm. No, oh, well, well played, well well defended, wasn't it? Good defence. <laughs> made me score. I, like he, he's, he's made me score, and he's got four turns and a reroll, and I've got no wizard. Like that was a great result for him. Terrible result for me. But better than failing one of the one in nines that you you know I could have made to fix it. <laughs> You're playing elves, you twat. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't get me I'm just saying it for the benefit of everybody watching and everyone who says I'm fucking toxic when it's not true it's just not true okay I know people are piss takers I'm not flapping dickhead I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. That's not toxic mad skill. Norse, Norse coaches fucking deserve death. That's a reprieve from them. That's a fucking. That's fucking. That's probably the nicest thing I could do for them. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh man. Diced. <laughs> I could have apple that, but it doesn't matter, does it? It's just a line up. It's almost certainly going to be a draw now. I don't know, maybe I should have risked the 1 in 9s. And... Like, you know, obviously the 1 in 9s usually work, and then it's much more likely to be a win. But I know I would have hated it if I'd lost. And I don't really hate drawing. I mean, he's got Dutch on the ball carrier, which is all he needs Dutch on. I fucking run out of players in one turn. In one turn I've gone from a team to fucking zero players. It's not a safe ball, it's a pretty fucking safe ball.
Hmm. One dice that and then blitz. That is a very safe ball. If you think I'm going to 1D and then 1D to hit the ball. <laughs> Maybe Mr. Pal. I mean, Chunter would go for it. Chunter would 1D, Pal, Kaz, and then 1D, Pal, Kaz the ball. But I would skull, skull, die. <laughs> that's, that's why, I, oh my fucking god, can just fuck off every blitz being, every block being a Kaz. Dead Apple is dead, dead guard as well, cold, yeah, well done. Called it mad skills, yeah. Choose misery, choose death. Chose misery. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Uncle Sherman. I might, I might continue doing it on YouTube. I might like stream to YouTube. I've got to work out how to do it. I'll have to work out how to stream on YouTube. But I might. Oh, here we go. We've got a ball hit now, potentially. Potentially. This is more my style, two 2Ds for a 2D at the ball. That's that's much better, isn't it? Problem is, it's a dodge and a GFI. I think I'll go for it. And there's the first one in nine, and it's an instant fail. There we go. That's why I didn't... Uh, that's why I didn't go for the win in this game. <laughs> Yep. Absolutely standard. I can just make an alt. I can either make an alt poggler, I can either make an alt for Twitch or I can uh, or I can stream on YouTube or I can do both. But what I certainly can't do is stream on Jimmy Fantastic. That's that's what I can't do because Unfortunately, uh, stream battle but this cost me a lot of money. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I mean, I could do both. I could have an alt and stream battle. Like, I could have an alt for Minecraft and stream battle brothers on YouTube. Well, I mean. If Blood Bowl 3 is a disaster, then Jimmy Fantastic can be Minecraft or uh, or Battle Bros or whatever, right? Like if it that if it's the main game, then I've got no choice. But at the moment, you know, obviously I get I get view I only get viewers playing Blood Bowl, so the JF channel is only for Blood Bowl because average viewers fucks my uh, if I get less average viewers, it fucks my ad revenue offer. Yeah, I mean, everyone does, right? That's why I get far more numbers doing Blood Bowl than anything else. But the way the ad revenue thing works, it's made it's made it so that all I can do in this channel is Blood Bowl. Good. Halfway there. Oh, can I go this way? No. Oh, oh, diced. Double one. <laughs> it's 
standard GFW. Yeah, that's fair enough. <laughs> Glorious Pugly. Oh, thanks, Frosty. Nah, that was a brutal second half here. <laughs> Four cars. Two of them instant. And then one of them apple fair. Actually losing the guard it really sucked. But hey, at least I didn't lose. You know, if I'd gone for the dodge first on that tricky turn, I'm pretty sure it was gonna fail. Like I don't know, it probably was plus EV to do the one in nine dodge first on the on the tricky turn because he was always pretty likely to score in four. But, uh. But hey. A mighty blower. Lovely. If I can find it, there we go. A blocker. Another blitzer. And it's still fine, isn't it? Nothing's nothing of value was lost really. <laughs> this is fine. I get another line on. And yep, yeah, it's not terrible. Obviously the draw's not ideal, but what can you do? Thanks for watching, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.